Hey everyone, um, so I'm going to be doing a haul as you can see from the title and um, it took me ages to decide what to do. I didn't know whether to do a haul or a lookbook with all, the, all of the new items that I bought and so I asked and it was so half and half so <laughs> I just thought I'll do a haul, I'll show you everything you know and have a little chat and then I'll do a lookbook. Hope you guys like it. I changed around the background a little bit because it's nice to change it up sometimes. So I've got some ASOS misguided. I got some Zara, I got a piece from H&M, and I'll get into it. I'm feeling quite chilled today, so it's not gonna be a yelling in your face kind of video, hopefully. <laughs> but I do tend to get a bit excited about items. Okay, first I'll show you some things from Misguided. So I got, it's a white, probably pleather, uh, sleeveless jacket. And it looks like that, and it's actually quite good quality for the price I got it, because I got it reduced. If everything is still available, I'll link everything downstairs, uh, down in the description box. <laughs> it has this kind of slightly oversized fit. I think it would look cool with um, the other items being quite like tied to like tight black like, jeans or and heels, and then this, and I think it would look great. I got this jacket, which you guys have already seen because I uh, featured it in my style Q and A video. But this I've seen it everywhere at the moment. I think it's going to be such a massive kind of blogger. <laughs> jacket. It's this really soft buttery suede type of mustard yellow um, jacket. Uh, it's like a crotch jacket. I love the fall of it. I think the quality is pretty good. I mean it's for about £40 but the quality is very good. I feel like it would last you quite a long time. I don't think years and years but I think you'll get a lot of use out of it. If you want to add a little bit of colour to your wardrobe and you're usually a black and white girl like me <laughs> then uh, Check this out. I had been looking for a white midi skirt for ages because I think it'll be a really good piece for when you want to switch it up a bit from wearing the usual black midi skirts and stuff. Anyway, so I found this one just from Misguided. It's really, it's a basic one. It's just a jersey kind of ribbed. It's a nice fresher take on a midi skirt and just a good piece to have in your wardrobe. Then I got this, I really like this top. I wore this, I think in the style Q&A as well. It's this, um, Right, so I don't love the 70s trend, but some bits of it I will dabble in. And when I saw this, I really fell in love with it. It's like a bell sleeve, chiffony type of top. Um, at the back it has uh, like an open detail. And I just loved the fall of this. Um, it's very feminine, very floaty. Um, a lovely piece to juxtaposition with something else that's a bit more edgy. But I also think it's really versatile because you could wear this with a mini skirt and boots or you could wear it with jeans or you could wear it with a leather skirt or you could, you know, you know what I mean? You could just switch it up. It's really very flattering as well, which I love, you know, it really skims over your body. Oh, I got this little baby from Misguided. I got this before I went away to Ibiza. So it's this beautiful, I love the colour of it, it's a buttercup yellow dress with an open back, well a cross back, um, just a lovely feminine cut and I got this actually for either when I was away on holiday or for wearing uh, like if we do a little barbecue at home or something and I just thought it would look really pretty. It's pissing it down in the UK so I can't wear it but when it is sunny I can't wait to wear this and I can't wait to style this for my blog because I think yellow looks really nice if you've got tan skin especially so um, I'll link there. I really like this dress. I think it's quite timeless as well. It's not really a trendy piece which I love because it's a very classic pretty feminine um, style. Okay, then I got some items from ASOS. I'm just always on ASOS. It's so dangerous, especially late at night or if I'm in a bad mood and I'll just be like, oh, and I'm just like, I'm gonna browse on ASOS and I just add everything to my uh, save for later and then I buy it. So you guys have probably seen this black bag that I've got, which looks like this. I wear it all the time. It's always on my blog. It's so handy. I shove it just fits so many things. And so I thought I'd get it in the nude. So here it is in the nude. <laughs> Not literally in the nude. It's one of those bags that I think gets better with time, as I guess most leather things do. It's real leather. It's not too expensive at all. Again, it's a nice, fresher take on the usual black bag that you just shove stuff into. And it will go really well with more colorful items as well, like yellow and nude. I think would look really nice together as well, for example. So I saw these on Victoria, oh, I don't know how to say the second name. It's like Victoria Torngren. <laughs> I'm probably saying that's totally wrong. She's a Swedish blogger who I love. 
and I saw these on her blog and I put them, put it off for ages and I was like, oh, they're only cheap, I'll just get them. So they're these, so loafers are quite trendy at the moment, or they were, <laughs> maybe I'm late, but they're these croc pleather loafers. And if you're not sure about the trend, these are great because they're cheaper than a lot of other loafers, so it won't break the bank. And I like them. Um, so this is a long line cream jacket, blazer jacket. I never know how to explain these things. So, looks like this. Um, it's slightly oversized because I got it a size up because it didn't have my size. But um, I just think this is lovely, especially for this time of year because the weather's kind of gonna transition soon. So to chuck this over you, I think will look very, oh, look at it. I just, I'm getting really into white things instead of black things. Like, um, if I've got a really good black staple piece, I'm getting into getting a white version as well, just to mix things up and make things a bit fresher. So it just looks quite sophisticated, quite put together, um, quite classy, more expensive, I think, as well. The next thing I got is from Mango. And I think I have a new love for Mango. I think growing up, I was like, oh, it's like an old woman's store. <laughs> but I've, I've been in recently and I've been like, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> I saw this and it just, the first thing that came to mind was Chanel. Because doesn't it look so Chanel? It's soft, cottony jacket, um, which basically is like a Chanel jacket. It looks classy, it looks kind of a bit older, a bit, uh, it looks very feminine and soft. Um, you know, it gives you a very soft look as opposed to a leather jacket. And this was $39.99. I've got it in a size medium, so it kind of fits over whatever I want to wear, and it, and that I can, so I can wear it over my shoulders because I like doing that. Yeah. So, I like it. <laughs> um, I'll link it down below. Hopefully, it's still available. In, I was on Oxford Street and I popped into H&M just because I had a bit of free time. I saw this. Look at this. It's this leather croc oversized clutch. This was expensive though, I ummed and ahmed for a little bit because it was $39.99 but I just think it's so my style, I love it, it's very good quality, it's very sturdy, it really holds its shape. I just think it would look awesome with loads of different outfits, it would look really good for the blog and it's great also for daytime. Next I got sent this, well I got contacted by this swimwear brand called To Die For and I had a little look on their website and I really liked this bikini so they sent it over. So the top, oh isn't it so pretty? This is the top, it's this kind of appliqued lace as you can see. It feels like it will fit really well. I've got it in a medium top and small bottoms and I'll link their website down below because it's very good quality and it's such a beautiful design it just looks it looked very different and really pretty so i thought i'd share that with you <sighs> the star piece of this haul <laughs> i don't think i've ever been so like excited by uh, a delivery um and jason was like what the hell <laughs> i was like hyperventilating and stuff so i've wanted this bag for ages and it's from zara and okay i'll just show you first it's this one it's the city croc city and croc city bag, I don't know, <laughs> 89.99. So spending that much in one item, on one item in Zara, I was like, eh. Then I decided to do it, couldn't find it anywhere. And then um, the other day I went looking for it again online and they were selling it again. So I was like, oh my God, <sighs> look at it. <sighs> um, what can I say? I think you can see, I mean, the, it's great quality, it's got a good weight to it, but I think it's probably stuffed with some stuff as well. Yeah, it is. Me? This just came today, so I haven't worn it or anything yet. It's still got the label on it. It's got this kind of brushed silver hardware. So that goes really well with my style as well, because I wear so much silver, as you can see. <laughs> I just can't, there are no words. <laughs> it's quite big inside, it's got two different compartments. So that's again perfect. It's quite a heavy bag though. I d have realized that right now, which is not good if you have back problems. <laughs> that's the last thing in this haul. I also got some red Converse, which I'm just looking at now, but is that interesting? I got some red Converse, these suckers. I've got white Converse, black Converse. Now I've got red Converse. I love this shade. 
just great to chuck on while you're, you know, walking the dogs, running errands, or when you want to look a bit more casual. I hope you guys liked this haul, and I'll be doing a lookbook really soon, because I, I love doing lookbooks, and I love doing hauls, and I just didn't know what one to do, so just stay tuned. I've got another little giveaway for you. Um, I'm going to give away this How To Be Parisian, How To Be Parisian, wherever you are book. Um, I haven't read it or anything, it's brand new. I mean, I've read it, I've got my own one. <laughs> so all you have to do to win this is to be subscribed to my channel here on YouTube. You can, okay, there's two ways. You can leave a comment down below um, saying that you've entered and slash or you can have a double chance of winning. You can follow me on Instagram, upload a picture on Instagram. It could be a screenshot from this video or it can be anything you want, but tag me in it and uh, write in the, your caption that you've entered the giveaway. I'll put everything down below. I'll put everything that I'm wearing down below and I will see you guys very soon. Check out my blog for my style posts and outfit posts and lifestyle kind of jazz. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a like, leave a little comment down below, and um, thank you for watching. Bye. Mwah.